This is the Erica Synth sequential switch module. It allows you to sequence a variety of CV and audio signals. You have the option to send one in and up to eight outs, or up to eight ins and one out. You can feed the inputs and outputs with a variety of different sources, including oscillators, sequencers, filters, etc. The sequential switch has several different play modes, which can be accessed with the manual step and manual reset buttons on the upper left. If you hold down the manual step button, you can enter a manual select mode, which will hold the gate on the channel you select. The LED button indicates the currently selected channel. This mode is particularly useful if you want to isolate whatever is happening on that step, as well as pitches corresponding to the knob on the optional CB expander. To exit manual select mode, simply press the manual step button once. Note that when you return from manual select mode, all steps are turned on regardless of which steps you had active prior to that mode. If you quickly press the step button twice, it deactivates that step. A single press will turn it back on. Push and hold the manual step and manual reset button for two seconds to enter piano mode. The gate signal stops once you release the step button. Note that the gate output on the sequential switch needs to be connected to the CV input of your VCA or the trigger input of your envelope on your sound source. To exit piano mode, press both buttons at the same time to return. The manual reset button also acts as a shift button. If you hold down the shift button while pressing each of the step buttons, you'll be able to access eight different play modes. Forward. Rewind. Ping Pong, Round, Eight Channel Ping Pong, Two Forward, One Rewind, Three Forward, One Rewind, and two-step. The CV expander allows your sequential switch to be used as a versatile eight-step sequencer. You can select one volt, five volt, and three volt modes via the switch on the upper right of the CV expander module. If you hold two buttons, it ties them together. There is also a reset input. If you plug in any modulation source, it will reset before the end of the sequence back to step one. In this clip, we have two sequencers coming in on channel 1, the Stilson Hammer, and channel 3, the Make Noise Renee. The single output is going out to the Erica Wavetable VCO. 
Step two and four are also active and sending pitches which are tuned by the corresponding knobs on the CV expander module. In this setup, there are four sequences coming in from the Rene Stilson Hammer on the second and third channel and Copper Traces Seek routed into the switch with a single out to the Erica Wavetable VCO. In this setup, the Rene is sequencing three Erica Wavetable VCOs which are being mixed down into a single mono channel which is then routed into the single input of the sequential switch. Five channels are being outputted to a variety of different filters and effects modules. Here is one more example. The sequential switch and the CV expander are a powerful combination with endless routing possibilities as well as sequencing capabilities. Have fun.